I know humans of YouTube, either disgruntled Dr. Puss would like to atone for my sins and put it on public record that I apologize for the perceived bomb threat uh, that occurred in Ohio a couple of weeks ago and provide my heartfelt thanks to the brave men and women of the city and state of Ohio police departments. A parcel that was sent by myself, the disgruntled octopus, benevolent dictator, look me up, uh, was sent to my favorite YouTube personality. And unfortunately, it blew a little bit out of proportion. So I wholeheartedly cross all three of my hearts, uh, do apologize for the incident, and strongly recommend you click on the button below and check out what's actually transpired. I'll actually put up a little bit of a, a teaser in this video, just so you can actually have a bit of a watch and get an idea of what happened. Uh, but obviously there's a lot of people eating dogs and cats at the moment. However, I do want to bring attention to this uh, very unfortunate set of circumstances. So once again, I, the octopus, I apologize and I hopefully won't happen again, but I can't promise it. But thank you and make sure you watch the video. Bye. Disgruntled octopus, if you follow them, you know, he's just hell bent on world domination and taking over. And apparently he's doing this, you know, one package at a time here in the That's US. Right. <clears throat> one package at a time, huh? That's one right. package, yes. <laughs> okay. Um, so I'm just I'm just gonna jump right into it. I was doing a live whatnot show, which you know, it's a, a live selling platform. And I'm in the middle of the live, uh, which you can't just like stop and do anything. But I live next door, whichever way it is, uh, to my parents. And I have a lot of my packages. When they send packages, uh, I have them go to their address just because they have a, a covered porch out front. So I am doing the whatnot show. And my mother knocks on. She comes in the back door. So she comes over and she's standing, you know, off camera or whatever. And she's just got this real concerned look on her face. And I'm, I'm turning, I'm trying to, you know, what's going on. She's like, just, just go ahead, just go ahead. So Jill goes over my girlfriend, Jill, if you're not familiar, she, she was, you know, she does the whatnot shows with me. She goes over and talks to my mom and I'm trying to figure out what's going on and still sell these <laughs> things. And, uh, my so my mother walks over and she shows me a picture on her phone uh of a package and then my dad shows up because at first i'm thinking something is wrong something is wrong with one of my family members or, or something because my mother just has this concerned look on her face and i'm trying no. to do the show i gotta, I tell I gotta believe you're used to seeing concern on your mother's face you being <laughs> <a child. laughs> well yes so I'm going to back up a little bit to the package. So while I'm doing the whatnot show over at my folks house, my sister uh, was visiting and they were all sitting in the living room and they seen a guy walk up on the front porch and he like knocked on the door and then he left and she looks out the window and the guy gets on like one of those uh, hoverboards, like the, the hoverboard, you know, with the two wheels and, and, and he rides off out of the driveway and down the street. The um, get better gas mileage. They do. Um, so my sister steps out on the front porch to see, you know, if she can see where the guy is going and there's a package laying on the porch. And so she assumes that this guy came up on the porch, delivered this package and went off on a hoverboard, which is just, just odd. So here it is. is Ohio. Yes, here <laughs> is the package in question. And it's got some some writing on there. And I think I, I'm going to throw up a, a graphic here real quick. So this package says on the front, <laughs> if washed ashore, return to Mr. D Octopus, Octolair, Australia, Pacific Ocean. So my, <laughs> this, they're like, well, okay, this is weird. They didn't pick the package up. They didn't pick the package up. They didn't turn it over. They're just like, okay, some guy on a hoverboard just came and dropped the package on the porch, <laughs> knocked on the door and left. And okay. An octopus. <laughs> and, and so, yeah, they read the package. And so now they're concerned. Okay. They don't know what to do. My mother had came over to talk to me uh, about the package and she had taken a picture, uh, that picture right there that I just showed. 
okay so i'm <clears throat> trying to do the whatnot show live and my mother shows me her phone and i'm just looking at it you know and every it's it's no secret i can't see anything you know i i need to get glasses i've talked about that a hundred times so i'm trying to look at this picture and decide what's going on while i'm doing the live i and i'm like i don't i don't know so they leave my parents leave well they go home and they call the authorities they call <laughs> the police to come to the house because this is just an odd situation uh the police show up so i have i have this i have this right here i'm gonna play a little little video clip this is from our our uh security cameras over there flash there i shine the light through you can see something yellow but that's about the best i can see so kind of gave a little thing on the right side's heavy left side okay so if you guys Back there for a little bit longer, that'd be great. Uh, yeah, I'll reset that edge real quick. Should be opened up. Uh, at one point, if you could hear them, they told my mother, can you guys, you know, just, just go back, back to the back for a little while? And well, I'm uh, glad I didn't go with my original plan of putting wires outside the box. <laughs> <laughs> So the uh, and I guess from what I could tell the scene out front of on our street like every every authority wa was there every okay my street is kind of odd because I live within the city limits okay that's what makes your street odd <laughs> well it does because the yellow the yellow line down the center of the street my neighbors that live across the street they live in the county okay so now there's a jurisdiction issue between whether it's the county sheriff that needs to take or whether it's the it's the city police really but <laughs> in order to block off the street now they have cop cars on on either end of the of the streets blocking off this whole section of the road so no traffic can get get through and from what i understand there was at least six eight police vehicles out in the front now all the neighbors are out on their porch you know wondering what the hell's going on over so uh moving along i'm so now i'm doing the show but i'm somewhat distracted because i don't really know what's what's going on next door so now my folks show up at my house again and i'm like okay what's going on i have jill take over the show for a minute and they had to, uh, our local police department and the county sheriff they don't have a bomb sniffing dog they don't have a canine that would that can <laughs> sniff out bombs so now they have to call in the state police to come <laughs> down and bring their their you know bomb sniffing canine with them so, so now the state troopers are involved and they got the bomb sniffing dog and so you know then again now all the neighbors are really concerned about what the heck's going on well that dog moved the package like eight inches he probably would have set the bomb off <laughs> I, I know that's well, well, well what about the whole journey from uh from the pacific ocean you think they would have set the bomb off before then but concern about humanity but i'm actually starting to be concerned for the people of ohio at the moment <laughs> they're calling the yeah. police on a box <laughs> well it you know it was maybe a little bit um you know you, you always err on the side of caution you know and if my my Especially when dealing know, folks with me. Yeah, exactly. Well, they didn't. So now my folks are back over at my house because <laughs> the police won't let them, you know, on the property. And so my mother shows me the picture again. And then I really focus on it. I, I pinch in. I see that it says on the package there, you know, Mr. D Octopus, Octo Lair, Austria. And I'm like, oh, wait, 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 wait. I know who this package is from. <laughs> I know where this package came from. 